Hello and welcome back to our channel CodeLogic. So in this series we are seeing the hospital management system using Angular and Firebase. So in our previous videos we have seen how to add doctor, how to list all the doctors and editor doctor. So we have not watched that video, I request you to watch that video also. So in this video we are going to see how to delete a doctor. So without wasting any time, let's get started. So we'll go to our app inside shared folder. We have one service file data service. So here we are going to write one method delete doctor. This method will take one argument ID which is of type string. So we are going to use afs dot doc doctor slash plus id dot delete okay so we'll close this method so file we'll open new terminal here so we have to create one component so for that we have used ngg c component slash dashboard doctor slash delete component so inside doctor folder we have created one new component that is delete doctor okay so we'll close the terminal now we'll go to the component doctor and we'll open the doctor component dot ts file here uh, we have to write one method delete doctor so similar to the edit doctor and add doctor we have to write one method so we'll copy the add doctor method and we'll paste it here we'll change its name okay now a first thing uh, disable close is false okay then uh, autofocus is true and uh, we'll change the title to the delete doctor and button name to delete and we are going to open the delete doctor component okay so delete doctor will accept one parameter row of type any and here uh, we have one more one more parameter doctor name so that will be assigned using row dot doctor so we have imported all the missing components and when we get the data after that we have to call the delete doctor and we have to pass the id of that doctor and when the doctor is deleted successfully we have to show the snack bar so for that uh, we have to write one message doctor is deleted successfully so yeah now uh, we'll go to our doctor component.html file here we have to call that method so on click of delete we have to call the delete doctor method and we have to pass the row okay we'll close this file now we'll go to the delete doctor component.ts file similar to the add doctor component.ts file we have to inject the mat dialog data and then dialog reference inside which we have to pass our components name that is delete doctor component after that we have to define one variable doctor name of type string we have added all the missing import statements and we have to get the data for the doctor name so that will uh, going to get it from the data dot doctor name and also we need to define one more variable title so this will be our dialogues title
so when user clicks on the delete button the dialog will be open right so for that dialog we have one title which we have passed from the doctorcomponent.ts file now for the dialog you can see here when you click on the dialog this is how uh, it will look like right and these are the buttons so we'll go to the code and inside the mm, yeah this HTML file we have to copy it and we have to paste it here inside delete doctor component HTML file first we'll change its content so title will, will be like we have one variable title so we'll add that here title then we'll change the text are you sure you wanna delete this doctor and here uh, we have to pass the doctor name we'll remove this form field we don't need this but before that on no thanks we have to close the dialog so we have written one method there close and on ok we have to call the method delete so first we'll change name of button to delete and we'll write one method name that is delete after that we'll remove this mat form field and we have to define two methods now so we'll go to the delete doctor component ts file and here we have to define two methods close and then delete so when uh, user clicks on the close then we have to just call the dialog reference dot close method and when user clicks on the delete then uh, we have to define one variable const delete its value will be true and dialog reference dot close we have to pass that variable okay so that is delete mm, it's showing an error because the name and the method name is same so we'll change it to the delete doctor is true okay so now I will see it, the demo so when we click on the delete it is asking okay I'll show you on a delete the code logic Okay, the doctor's name is also getting printed there but the buttons was not looking good so for that uh, we'll go to our angular material and inside a button section so you can see here there are lots of options so we'll choose the raised buttons so we'll copy this accent color is accent so we'll go inside that and we'll change its class to mat raise button for closed and delete both now we'll click on delete okay it looks good now and name is also getting printed there so when you click on that message is also showing and the record is also getting deleted so yeah that's it for the video guys if you like the video please like share and subscribe thanks for watching see you in the next video till then bye bye